Hello, hello, hello everybody out here on YouTube. It is I here with Beautiful Beauty. Gonna be talking about skincare today. Just, I want to share one of my repurchases, one of my favorite products, uh, one of my favorite brands, all that good stuff. So, let's try and not make this one a 20 minute video, okay? Let's try for it. I say that, it'll be 25 minutes, okay? <laughs> Let's get started here. This is the brand Badger. I love the I love Badger Balm. I love the brand Badger. I love their skincare. You guys know this. I love, love, love their oil. I love their skincare. I love their beauty creams for the face. Love, love, love. And I love their lip balms and their chapsticks and all that stuff. So really good stuff here. This is one of my rebuys of repurchase or repurchase. Extremely familiar with this product. I like to buy this from Vitacost.com and if I don't buy it there, I buy it from Swanson'sVitamins.com. So either one. I rebuy the product very frequently, so very often. This one is the Badger Certified Organic. This is the Chamomile and Calendula. 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 That is great stuff. Yes, I know what it is. Now, I have heard it pronounced every which way but loose, so, you know, Calendula, Calendula, yeah. So it has the chamomile and calendula, and it's USDA organic. This is the baby balm, and I love it. This size of tin is two ounce. This is the two ounce tin, so this is the larger tin. I believe the other tin size is the 0.75 size. I love this stuff. It works as a multifunctional, multitasking product. And I just uh, bought this yesterday, so I had to go ahead and stock up on it. So I just used a little bit last night. And I just take my, my finger, like I take clean fingers, of course. Please wash your hands. Do it for me. Do it for real beautiful beauty. I'm a little bit of a germaphobe. You guys know this. So I just take the back side of my nail and just kind of flip it up like that. I love it. It's a multi-purpose, multi-functional, multi-tasking type of beauty treatment. Okay, now, I do not wear this during the day. First off, let me say this. It is way too thick, way too emollient, way too creamy, and a little bit too oily to wear under cosmetics or makeup. Now, I don't use it for that purpose, but I wear it at night. I love it. I go full on. I go full force. I go heavy at night, you guys. I use the products at night, and I let them work their magic and do their wonders, you know, while I'm getting ready for the next day, while I'm sleeping, while I'm not sleeping, while I'm having an insomnia spell or whatever it is I'm doing, you know what I mean? This stuff works great. You can use it as a lip balm. I love to use this under eye balm. Love, 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 love it. I have very dry sensitive skin first off and I love to use this under my eyes, around my eyes. I even love to put it in my eyebrows because it works really well as a natural conditioner for your eyebrow hairs. I have, um, you know, I have, pretty thick eyebrows but um you know of course i've complained about this before you guys you know the outer tail ends of my eyebrows are missing those decided to fall out a few years ago for whatever reason you know um i think it's thyroid related but uh you know how that goes so anyhow i have thicky 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 does that make sense i have thick otherwise eyebrows you know what i mean they're fairly bushy and um, I like to condition them with this product. So at night, I like to rub it in my eyebrows. Works great. I rub it into my eyelashes. That works great too. I rub it under my eyes as an eye under eye cream type of balm. Love it. It works fantastic. Love it. Um, and also, if I am coloring my hair, highlighting my hair, doing all that I do to my hair, I change my hair color, you know, a lot so not real often but often enough so I like to do highlights you know up around the roots of my hair I will we'll pop in a few highlights do that and to keep you know hair color or all that off of my forehead I will use this you know put a nice layer and it really works well as a barrier when you're coloring your hair so if you're coloring your hair highlighting your hair doing whatever it is you do you know so your hair Definitely use this as a barrier on your forehead. It keeps it off your forehead. It kind of keeps it away from, uh, you know, the size of your ears and all that area. Love it. And it just works well overall on everything. I have very dry, sensitive skin, extremely dry skin. And I also like to use this on scars. If I have any small, you know, residual scars over the last few years that are just left over from whatever, you know, if I cut my finger or whatever, or I have a little scar here or there on my arm or my leg or my knee or something like that. I like to use this on there. I like to keep my scars hydrated and moisturized because it helps fade them out and it, it just, it diminishes the look of them. So this is a perfect scar uh, revision fader, if you will. It fades out scars. 
just love it as an eye cream love it as a lip balm um, you can even use it as a hand cream which I have done before you know and it doesn't take much just use a tiny dab and it really keeps your hands moisturized and then I could put on my handy dandy nighttime gloves and go to sleep and wake up with moisturized hands so there's really a lot of things you can do with this product it's cruelty free it's not test on animals love it love it love it and I love you guys even more take care bye beauties be sure to like, share, and subscribe.